Hey kids, comics. So we're here at Bronze Age Babe here, yakking about our comic book collection, and today talking about the absolute ugliest uh, graded slab I have ever seen in person. Um, I am collecting uh, signed copies of Neil Adams' 27 covers um, series, and uh, so I found this one, and worked with the seller to come up with a very reasonable price for this book. I really, I love the cover and, um, you know, to have this one signed, I was like, okay, I'll, I'll pay you a little more because you went through the, uh, effort of putting it in this thing. Um, I, I just, I cannot believe how unattractive this is. The, um, the PGX thing up top is just, uh, you know, brown. Are you kidding me? Brown? Really? Um, and it's just full of little bitty type. And the other thing that kills me about it is like, this is totally uneven. So it's, it's not symmetrical. It's not, <laughs> it's just gross. Um, you know, I don't have the same uh, feelings about the CGC uh, yellow labels, which is their color for a signature book. Um, but uh, I even have a, uh, CBCS, uh, yellow label that I think is fine. This is unacceptable. So I'm going to crack it. I'm going to remove it <laughs> and I'm going to, uh, reframe it so that it uh, looks much, much better. Uh, stay tuned and see what happens. Okay, if the PGX frames have anything to recommend them, it's the fact that it's super, super simple to crack these uh, with your handy dandy screwdriver. Uh, I've had harder times with uh, cracking open the CGCs, so um, <laughs> there's that. Okay, moving on. Okay, it has been released from its plastic sheath. Uh, getting the comic out was easy. The hardest part was <laughs> getting this uh, goldish brownish piece of paper out. And as you can see, I um, inadvertently ripped that. Um, but you can imagine how little I care. I will, however, save that uh, and affix it to the back of the frame uh, that this thing is going to go in. Okay, final step coming up. And there it is, a reframed uh, Neil Adams signed variant cover. And I love this. I think this looks far superior. Um, so this is a frame from the folks at Crafty Comics. I use their framing systems for my signed books. Um, I'm gonna cut this one more time <laughs> and show you how I display some of my books in my office uh, using not only Crafty Comics, but also Gator Guard. So hang in. And there it is. There is, uh, it's a, always a rotating gallery over in my office here, but the top row are the signed books that I've gotten recently, which again, I put those in the uh, Crafty Comics frames, and I really like the way those look. The Lois Lane books, uh, those are from Gator Guard. And I think those are just perfect for these high-grade, raw, uh, unsigned books that I've been collecting this year, too. So um, I'm a big fan of self-slabbing books, and uh, both companies have helped me out tremendously this summer. And uh, it just keeps this hobby fun. Well, thanks so much for stopping by. I'll see you next time.